so we need to upload switches how we can upload switches to eve ng so we need a win scp or any other ftp application so let me open win scp okay and my eve ng ip is 192.168.114.128 so let me type the ip here 192.168.114.128 and the file protocol will be sftp and port will be 22 username is root by default and password is eve okay and click save to save for the uh, next time okay and save password as well and click okay so this is 128 and click login okay this is the first thing and click update okay and now it will land you here so what you need to do click on this folder and go to opt and unit lab then adds on and there is iol and then bin for switches for iou switches you need to come at this location okay which i mentioned here so this is my local machine left side and this is the remote machine basically the eve ng we access them through WinSCP. Now you need to download router and switches images. Right now we need only switches images from this uh, Google Drive. Click on this Google Drive and I share the switches images. So here is and the zip format. I already download. Okay. And I put here this the switch images. Right click on that and use seven zip or any other zip application and extract them. Okay. So it will extract you to a directory which is this one okay these are the switches images so i use 7zip to extract two switches and after that i am already in this location i told you you need to go to this location opt unit lab adds on iol okay and then bend directory okay so if i go to winscp so i am already here opt unit lab adds on iol and bend directory and from left side what I need to do, I need to drag all these switches images. But keep in mind, your Eve ng name has to be Eve ng. So if I log in root and Eve, okay. So the host name is Eve ng. Why? Because the device is licensed on this name, the switches images. Sorry. Eve dash ng. Okay. So now I need to go here. And from left side, I'm already in the directory, go to switches. And if I open this one, let me edit this. I O. this is the licensing. You know, the name is Eve NG. This is the only thing you need to remember. If your name is different, so your switch will not run. And drag all these switches, IOL, not only switches images, by the way, it's router as well. The one which is start from L3, these are the router uh, images for IOL. Okay, this is these are the Linux based switches uh, Cisco developed for their internal use, but we can use in our lab as well. And the one which is start from L2. So these are the switches images, not only layer two switch images, it can work as a layer three switch images as well. But anyway, for understanding purpose, the one which is start L3, these are the router and the one which is start with the two so these are the switches images so what i done from here i drag them here a next thing what you need to do when it's finished the dragging so you need to apply the fix permission command which you can search on google as well and copy from here and what you need to do you need to go to control l to clear the screen by the way let me click inside and clear the screen and from here edit and you can paste so this is the command but when is uh, done so then i will apply the fix permission command and after that we can use these switch images in our lab okay so it's almost done all the images are done and now click enter to apply this fix permission command and after that i need to go to 192.168.114.128 and just refresh this one and what you need to do right click and go to node and here type IOL, Cisco IOL. And here these are the switches images, L2, as I told you, and these are the layer three. So let me choose any of this image and change the name to because it's R. 
let me change them to switch and change the icon to switch image as well so let me go down and choose the switch suppose layer 2 and save that's it and now the switch images is there and click start if there is any issue so it will never start suppose the license file which I told you okay and maybe the virtualization is not enabled the second thing you need to check that virtualization is enabled on your Eve NG it can be a community or professional edition so this has to be enabled and the license file I told you the name has to be Eve NG okay and now click on this one so if you have installed a client pack so it will open on putty or any other thing in my case it open in the a secure CRT and you can see switch is working so this is the way how we can install uh, switches okay and you need to go to Cisco IOL the only thing you need to change the name and icon by default the icon is router and also the name is by default R okay and that's it so this is the way how we can uh, upload switches images to EVE NG and how we can use them in our lab.